Alright lads, so today we're going to be reviewing Inform Roman Shirikov, plays for FC Krasnodar in the Russian League, he's 6 foot 1 tall, he's right footed, he's got high medium work rates, a 3 star weak foot and 2 star skills. Looking at his in games, his stand up to his 89 short pass, 87 vision, 86 long shot, 84 attack positioning and 83 shot power. We've also included all the upgrades over his non-inform as a comparison for you, so you can see each individual stat increase of all the stats. So you can always pause the video now if you want a close look at any of these stats. So this is the team we were using Inform Shirikov in, a 4-2-3-1 Russian league team with Inform Shirikov in the middle at Cam. So now onto the gameplay, so you can see how he was performing. Now it does look actually a pretty nice overall card, and his stats actually do live up to that in-game. He's actually really well-rounded. His lowest stats are his balance and his jumping, which are in the 50s, which are quite poor, but not really as important in the game. Everything else is around the 70s and 80s. Pretty much everything is 70s and 80s. The odd one or two 60 here and there. Now his pace is only average. But it isn't actually that bad, you know. It is useful enough, especially playing as we did, as a cam, or if you want to play him in centre midfield. More than enough pace for that. You don't need him electrically fast. And you can play him pretty much anywhere through the middle with his versatility, with his all-round stats. He is pretty solid anywhere. Does have decent defensive stats as well. So is solid in the middle of the pitch. And I think his biggest plus, his main weapon, is his passing game. He's got a cracking long and short pass. He's 89 short pass. I think it's 86 long pass so he does create a hell of a lot of chances for our team with his passing does have a cracking pass now he does only have a three star weak foot though but i was noticing he was playing a lot of nice outsider of foot passes some decent nice through balls and cross field balls great little dink through passes as well so great creatively if you want to plonk him at cam behind your strikers or even as a deep liar playmaker in centre mid. Now he's fairly robust as well, did I think 75 strength and he wasn't, to be honest, he wasn't losing out on many challenges uh, when we were challenging for the ball. Didn't really get shoved off the ball easily either so that is a good thing handy when you're trying to retain possession in the midfield now his dribbling is not too bad at all uh, not really that smooth is a bit slow but it is manageable in the middle certainly can get by with his dribbling now he does have a decent shot on him though did manage to grab this decent outside of the foot effort from outside of the box curls it round clips in off the post so quite nice finish from outside of the box there with Shirikov does have decent long shots high 70s as the long shot take a trait as well and he does actually use the outside of his foot quite a lot I was using with his passing and shooting which I do like to be honest and he does have actually decent finishing inside of the box as well did manage a few goals for our team was actually taking the most of his chances another uh, big plus if you want to play him in the cam role for supporting your striker will be able to get you the goals no worries about that now he does have high attacking work rate so as we said in the cam good for supporting your striker does have good attack positioning as well so it does get into creeping into some nice positions only real downer on Shirikov is unfortunately he only has two star skill which you have to stick with ball rolls which is one of the easiest skills to pull off and is still effective if you time it right so let's have a look at Inform Shirikov's performance stats. So in seven games, he did manage five goals and get three assists. All of his stats are on the left, goals are on the right. Position map shows you where goals were scored and assists were created as well. So overall, we're giving Inform Shirikov a solid eight out of 10. Now it does make a great all-round midfielder. As we said, great all-round stats, is really versatile, has a great creative game as well with his great passing and he can find the back of the net as well with his decent shot. Decent from range as well. Did manage that nice one from outside of the box. So can be played at Cam as we were playing him to support your striker or even at centre midfield with his uh, decent defensive game. Pretty robust as well in the middle. Could even manage at CDM at a push or even centre forward. Depends on what you need him to do. It is versatile as we said so worth a buy. Only bad points apart from his skills maybe. Three star weak foot. Personally, I didn't really notice that he was just sticking to his right, as we say, with his outside of foot. But personally, I didn't find both of them too much of a problem, to be honest. I can just get by with ball rolls. Now, his price range is only 10 to 25k, so fairly cheap. So finally, we're just going to show you Inform Shirikov's positives and negatives for you to have a look at. As we said, makes a really solid choice in the middle with his all-round stats. Uh, really a must-buy if you're making a Russian league team or a Russian national team. Definitely want to get in there. Highly recommended for them teams. And he is a bargain as well. I got him for 11k. So around discard price, pick him up, give him a go. You're not going to be losing out on too many coins if you don't get on with him. 
So hopefully you did enjoy this review. If you did, please leave a like. It does help out a lot. And please subscribe if you're new to the channel as well. Loads more to check out. We try to do the most in-depth reviews on YouTube. Loads more to come as well. So stay tuned for them. Thanks a lot for watching, lads. Cheers, lads. See you later.